From movie theaters to streaming services and even virtual reality video games, how we experience entertainment has changed rapidly, even just in the past decade. Undergoing changes in how we experience entertainment raises the question of when an entertainment medium is considered a motion picture. For this determination, we'll see in Landon vs. 20th Century Fox Film Corporation that the context of how the term motion picture is used in a contract as a whole is a key focus. In 1944, Margaret Landon sold the motion picture rights to her book, Anna and the King of Siam, to 20th Century Fox. She also gave Fox the exclusive motion picture copyright to new versions, adaptations, and sequels. In addition, the contract gave Fox the exclusive right to make, sell, and produce motion picture versions of the book and gave it the exclusive right to broadcast the motion pictures on television. However, Landon reserved the right to televise her book using living actors after a 10-year blackout period. In 1972, Fox produced several direct-to-television films based on Landon's book in a weekly series called Anna and the King that aired on the CBS television network. Landon sued Fox for copyright infringement, among other claims. Landon argued that the contract only gave Fox the right to make feature-length films that would initially be shown in theaters, not to make television productions. Landon and Fox moved for summary judgment. 